it's a challenge for any library how to attract teenagers to their quiet cerebral environment but it looks like the greater victoria public library has found the answer v cooper introduces us to the teen zone oh i read this if there's one word that most people associate with a library it's shh that doesn't look like a spider but there's one area at the Greater Victoria Public Libraries with no shushing allowed. It's the teen zone. A couple of years ago, the Victoria Foundation's Vital Signs report um, noted that teens, while they liked coming to the library, they felt that there just wasn't enough space for them to do their work. Or to chat with friends the way teens do online. When the teens were trying to use the computers mixed in with the adult use, we had a lot of conflict because teens want to be social. GVPL knew this was a challenge they wanted to fix because they didn't want teens to feel pushed out. We are the community living room and they want it to have their own space. And what better way to learn how that space should look than to talk to the group that will use it. I just recently joined the teen council of the library this year and um, they told me all about the survey that they did last year. The previous council members went around and asked a bunch of teens about how they wanted the teen zone to be. In fact, more than 300 teens answered the survey. They wanted better light, more natural lighting, comfy places to sit, but also study spaces and places where they can be a little bit boisterous and use computers together. You have this nice area and then like if your friends come, you, it's a nice place to hang out because there's not a lot of noise, so it's nice. So has the GVPL seen an increase in the number of teens visiting their various branches? And the teen zones are filled every day, especially after school, and we know that about 150 teenagers use their teen zones every day. I didn't really know there was like a teen zone here or whatever. I, I just, um, like, I, I just came here to hang out, but <laughs> this is kind of nice. So having this space for them over here where they can buddy up and look at what each other are doing and chat while they're working has just been wonderful. Because you have a lot of work for school and stuff that you need to be alone with, right? So I think it's cool that there's a space in the library for just teens to be able to do what they need on the internet. And maybe keep them coming back to the library right into adulthood. This check program is brought to you in part by Victoria Foundation, connecting people who care with causes that matter.